Hi, and welcome to another fun and awesome video. I am John. I am Riley. And this is, and together we are the Scorpion and Barber Show. And today we are going to be doing archaeology digging, looking for gemstones. So we're going to get started by opening up the boxes. And so then, right now we're going to do a bit of an unboxing. Uh, yes, an unboxing. So we'll start doing that now. I'm going to show one thing. Let's start unboxing then. And right. now I have to figure it, it's eight years old. Yes. You open it down here at the side. And, and we just open up the box. We slide the plastic tray out. How the hell do you open it? Alright, so that's How that's my box one done. Alright, what you do, Riley, is you just pull this out. I tried to! Put it on its side and just pull the tray out. Mm -hmm. And we move the box mm. to it's the like side. Right. Bubble wrap. So now we'll take this phone off. Take this phone. So, and we'll move that to one side. And now um, when you open it, right. you have these little tweezers. Right. And you also have and instructions. You have tweez it comes with tweezers. It does. Br a brush, a chisel, and a magnifying glass. And this is the um, thing that um, you dig. But yeah, so this is the thing. So you've got, you have the... And you have the chisel to knock into the thing. Yes. So you have the actual thing that has all the gems in, and then you have your magnifying glass, magnifying your little chisel glass. and hammer thing, and then you have your tweezers and a little brush just to brush the dust And away. when you get a gem out, and um, you um, use the tweezers to pick them up, yeah. and then you have the magnifying glass to identify what gem you get. Yes you do, yeah. And so we grab all these things out. Does it out. say what gem you get on you? No, uh, no, I don't think so. Wait, it might. It may do, but the whole idea yeah, is... Yeah, doesn't it don't, don't it? I don't think it tells you for a reason, Riley, so that it, you're surprised when you get whatever gem um, you're supposed to get. It says, can you check one chalk and exploration block for 10 gemstones? It yep. has 10 gems it in it. It is made out of chalk. And B, um, uh, one chisel, one magnifying Magnif Fine glass. Fine glass. D dust. One dusting detail brush. One pair of tweezers. Yep. So we'll move that over. Congratulations on your purchase of the gem mining kit with excavation tools. Please read all instructions and warning on this sheet. And uh, prayer to use the gem mining kit. Good. Yep. Gem mining kit. Excavation. Whatever it says. Excavation. Excavation tools. Keep this instruction sheet as it contains important information for future reference. References, yeah. Please read all safety warning before use. Yeah. So you might need So, to what we'll do is so we'll get these out of the bags and then we shall get started. Okay, I'll have to take them. Right, let's go. Let's see what we get. Uh, so I'm going to start chiseling here. You have to pick. Yeah, you just, you, just, you just like do this though. Do it slowly and just press into it at an angle. A bit more of an angle, really. So it's about that, like, like this. See, look, see how the angle I'm getting it? I'm digging it in. And then we're just going to get the brush and we're just going to brush them away. And already I have un I revealed a little stone. But I've got to try and reveal the rest of it. Um, it looks like something, but I can't really tell what it's stone sure. or gem it is. I don't know, but we will find out. It's, like a, re it's a real gem. They wouldn't give us a fake gem. In this. No, these are all real gems. Where do I rub the thing off? Just brush it to the side of the white chalk bo box thing. I'll rub chalk it off. Slab. Okay, mm -hmm. we'll just rub it onto this, but nowhere else. Just onto the placement, that's why we have the placement bit. Yeah, and we can always just wash it through. I think it'll be a bit just, of a gun on there. Yeah, I'm going to reveal a bit more. Why the hell did I say my merch? Um, that one. That's what I, I re-corrected myself. Okay, I bit I've revealed a bit more. Oh, this one looks like a white one. I think this may be a crystal. It looks like a see-through crystal. It does, doesn't it? It kind of looks like an amethyst. Okay, and a quick interruption. This is our new merch. The, Sm the Scorpion and Viper Show with the V and the S in the middle. Soon we are going to make a website no. and then we will sell heaps of shirts. And we will be making the t-shirts and jumpers and everything else like that all by hand. 
with a machine that we'll be getting at a when later we, date. When we create our website, we will, um, on our video, we will tell what the website is called so you can go on it if you want to and get our merch if you want to. Yes. We and we're going to have hoodies, caps, pants, shirts like we do. And at the minute the site's not up and running, so at the minute there will be no merch. Don't have like a site right now, but we will be making one. I just said that so that would make. Yep, that's fine. Because every YouTube makes a YouTube website. I know. Or not everyone if they don't know. But they presume not me from YouTube. Yep. So eventually we will get this site up and running and we will start making our own merchandise yeah. like we have because these these two were designed by me and Raleigh with the circle around the front and the V behind the S for Viper, Scorpion and Viper and we do have other symbols we actually have a game an Xbox controller that's made from a Viper but it's also shaped as an S and we also do have a green and black Scorpion one that yep. we're going to be putting on um, some of the hats and clothes as well. And clothes. And we're going to do ladies' pants, men's pants, hoodies. It's hats. suitable for all ages, Riley. It's going to be suitable for all ages. And you can do whatever size small, large, medium, extra large. If we can find any ones that allow us to do that. Yes, we will, Riley. It's going to be for all ages and all sizes. That's what, at least what we're trying to aim for. Oh, hell. And all different types of colours as well. Don't do it like that. Just chisel it like I've done, look. Yeah. Now, and then go, look. See what I've done? I've, I'm trying to reveal the stone, more and more of the stone. How do you do that? I just do this, look. Wiggle it. Wiggle it in, and it goes straight down. But do it at an angle. See, because I've also revealed two stones now. There's a second stone I've revealed. What? This one looks more, more greenish. Yeah, that, more like a green colour. Um, it kind of looks like an emerald. Like an uh, emerald is like a dark green or yeah. light green, and it kind of looks like that. Yeah. So it but, might be an emerald. But as you can see, look what I'm doing. How I'm chiseling it out. Look, you see. Look. Just watch what Daddy does. And look, I wiggle it, and it just scrapes bits and bits away. And it makes a bigger hole. Yeah, but you don't need to twist it, you just wiggle it and it chisels its way in. I did. There you go, that's Wait, better. It's itchy. That's alright, you don't have to make it up. <laughs> Got itchy foot. That's alright. Ouch, I hit my head. Um, I was going to say hit my head, but I hit my knee on the table. That's alright. As long as you're okay. My head. I'm wiping all the dust. Well, we all, we all hurt ourselves. It's like dust. This is, I said dust, but it's chalk. Alright, let's get more of this stone out. This is like dust, but I'm calling it dust because they will get me. And then I fell backwards off the chair. A little more of this stone here. Oh, here we go. I wonder where one more. We is. finally revealed the stone. Um, can you pick it out? Wow. I've seen one of them before. This just looks like a normal everyday crystal, like Not a see through. I have like a little oh. crystal So this is a, one, one of the gemstones that we've got already. I haven't found See? any yet, but I do actually have like a gemstone so. thing <clears> and <throat> it has all sorts of gems in it. Yep, so I'll place that one here on the other separate map. And it probably does have an emerald in there. So I'll place mine on this side and you place yours on that side and we'll see what stones we've got and we can compare the two. Just brush the stones off. Yep, so that's the first reveal of a st um, crystal or stone. Rubbing the thing off, the, rubbing the chalk off the thing to the place now. Because I want my thing to be clean when I um, find a stone thing. So um, when I do it, 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 it doesn't get all chalky again. Yep. Oh, this one is a green one. It's a, it's a light that's green. That's like an emerald, I think. I think it's a see-through green stone. Oh, yeah. emerald. That's oh, what, there's another stone right beside it. That's an emerald, I think, then. Um, only emeralds are like light green or dark green. Okay. That's right. what I was talking about when you saw it. Dig it underneath a bit, chisel away the underneath, the sides. I think I found a gem. 
Look. Did you find one? Well, then use the brush just to clear it, clear the excess away, yeah, so that you can yeah, reveal the stone. Look. Careful. I'm gonna get it everywhere. Just lightly brush it like what Daddy's doing. Okay. Just like that. Just lightly brush it, just away from the stone and the hole that you made. See, like, look. Look at it. It's like a sea turtle one again. Oh, yeah. I think you may have the same one as I've got, um, but because it's surrounded by the white, it looks darker. And by the way, um, it, are they all the same gems in this? Uh, I don't know. Things? I would have no idea, Riley. When they were all, when we got them, it doesn't necessarily mean it's all the same I gems. I revealed more of the stone, or gem. I yep, and like I say, brush, just brush around it like that. Gemstone, gemstone. Clear stone, all the excess away. Gems and stones are pretty much the same thing. I'm brushing it and um, picking the dust off the thing. Off. The all right, thing. there we go. I've released the gem. I'm trying to um, like get the gem, put the chisel underneath the gem and flick the it gem. Wait, Ronnie, right, because you'll break, you'll break the thing. You gotta dig it around like an archaeologist. Literally, gotta dig it I'm out. I'm stabbing the so hard. Let's clear this off. So, if I can pick it up with the tweezers. Uh, so that's the second one. It's like a greenish, clear green. A uh, really light. It looks almost clear like the other one, but just well, a different off coloured white. Hit it on to your shorts. With a hint of green in it. I hit it on so, your shorts. I'll clean this one off and then we'll put it over here. Look at my one. I revealed more of it. You yeah. can see only like a tiny little bit. Now I can see like a hole. Yeah. That's good. Wait, there's a bit of it. I'm digging underneath. Bit of a brush up. Careful. Don't lose your chisel. I'm not gonna. I'll have to, I'll have to dig it out with your teeth. Mm, or, uh -huh. I, boop, boop. or I can do this. Let's do this. No, because then you break the brush. But it's more funny if you dig it out with your teeth. Why? Because it's just going to be funny if you do. All right. So there's the second stone. All right, let's try I think I another bit of a stone. Have you? Look, like we'll brush it away. A black thing. Okay, that's cool. All right. You want the hell stone? Oh, I've revealed two here. Did you know what I said? There's two in mine. Did you know what I said? Side by side. Did you know what I said? No, I didn't even hear you. What did you say? Mm. Oh, that's all right. Let's just try not to say it too much. Why? Let's forget this is for, aimed for kids as well. Um, Try not to say hell too much. Alright, I've got a purple one and a dark green here, solid green. I thought it was a dark green one. That probably is the same. I think that's the same one they've found. Oh no, that looks blue. That's like a dark blue. That's like an aqua. And you've got this clear one here too, so try and just... That's an aqua. It's yeah. an aqua gem. Aqua one. Well, it might look aqua, but in, when you reveal it, it'll be completely different. Because that looked really green until I revealed it out of the, the chalk. And now it looks warm. It looks like very dark, but now it's like light. Oh, this one's a long one. I think I might have scratched the see again. I might need to reveal all the sides so I can then I can take it. Yep. Yeah. And. I'm like trying to push like the sh the in my corner like around the gem so it'll like um you take off a bit of the around the gem. Alright, just chisel away at this thing here. Look how deep I've made it like right there. Maybe if I get it like like halfway more deeper I can probably lift put the chisel under there and just flick it out. Yeah maybe if you bring it more this way though like you know, dig more out. What here. I'm trying to do is put the corner like that and scrape Oh you're trying to scrape it out, okay that's cool. Like scrape it out so it'll make it like deep enough. Yeah that's another or way. Or like to make a little grate so it will be easier to fit the um, like chisel bit like in there so I can like get the thing out. Yeah. I'm trying more of the wiggle and scrape. How do you wiggle it? Just wiggle it like this. And it pushes it out. That's what I'm trying to do. I'm trying more than wiggle, like more being careful. Try not to chip or break the stones as we try and dig them out. Oh, can you do this? Wow, this one's like a pink sea to it. It's even got some flecks, the uh, dots in the middle, like where it looks like it's formed. Hmm. See, like it's got a little pink inside it, see through, but then has pink inside it. I just rubbed that off. That's all right. That's what you're supposed to do. No, it's all over my hand. Don't worry about it, it's only for chin chalk. You've got... It's all over my hands too, buddy. But it doesn't matter, I'm it's chalk, it wash it off. off. I'm brushing it off. 
Okay, brush it up then. The brush, but it's not really doing anything. Then don't worry about it until the end of the video. It's a smudging. Well, we'll sort that out at the end of the video, buddy. I'll we'll try and reveal more of these so I can get it out. This one looks like it could be a big one. It seems pretty, pretty deep. It probably is like a big fat gem. I don't know whether they, whether you can, you guys are can these see fake it. Gems but or real gems? I'll try and reveal a are bit more. Are these fake gems or real gems? They're real gems, buddy. Um, could you make money for selling them? No, you could not. Why? No. Because they're not worth money, right? No. They're just rocks. What if we found a diamond in there? Then you'd have a diamond, but I doubt it would be very worth very much. Yeah, but if you had a diamond, they actually are worth heaps. Mm, some are, some aren't. Well, the biggest ones are worth the most. If we found a big fat diamond in there, or I find one, maybe we can sell it. Or we can just oh, keep Hello, it. he's wiggling, he's wiggling. What? What happened to the corner? Wait, when it fell, or, or when um, I done that and my thing went... Yay, we've got him free. We've got him free. Okay, guys. So now this one is a pink. Oh, it's kind of a pink see through one. So it's got a lot of pink flecks in it. See? How did I don't you, know whether you can see the pink how flecks. How are you getting this out? Oh, I dropped him again. Oh, see, it's got a little a few pink flecks inside. Like it's, it's just clear with a bit of pink in it. A few imperfections on it, but that's I guess that's what stones are all about, really. What how they form? Oh, like little scrapes and scratches inside them. But that's how they form. Well, yeah, that's how they form. Or obviously. something. So accident. each imperfection is unique to each stone. So no stone is exactly the same. Yeah, because um, it's not. So we'll put that there in my collection. It's I have not really friends. possible to get the same gem all in a row. Like you can't get the same gem. No. And um, did you pick up the corner? No, I just picked around the stone like this. How the hell did you do that? How, How are you, you doing? Wiggle, and, you wiggle it did at an angle. That? No, at an angle. Like that? Like this. Like Literally this? like this. Have it at an angle and push as you're wiggling. Like this? Yeah, but not underneath the, underneath the stone, at the sides of the stone. So reveal this more of this place here. Get it from an angle here and dig in. That's better. But you don't want to break your chisel too. I'm doing if you have to, turn the chalk block I'm around. To... I don't think they'll be at the side, buddy. You don't know. That's where you found yours. Uh, more in the corner than the sides. It's like kind of like near the top corner. It's going to be a little bit more of this stone here. It's a green one. This one's a solid green, though. Some of my bristles are coming out of my brush. Oh, that's okay. It's only a bit of chalk. It can be cleaned up. I said holy. At least it's not the other word. Well, we are digging holes, so yes, it would be a holy piece of chalk. No, I said holy because there was like a, a bit of chalk that flew onto me. Yes, but Riley, it's chalk. You've played with chalk all your life. And um, yeah, you can draw with chalk. Exactly. This one's just basically white chalk. Um, yeah, you can Come draw on. the white Reveal him, reveal him. Ah, here we go, we've got him free. Now we have a solid green, solid green stone. See, as you can see, we've got a solid green stone. Kind of chain, shaped like a, a guitar pick. So you go boing, boing, boing. It's pretty cool. I that's okay. Yeah, so we'll put that there with the other collection. Oh, I just want to wipe it on there. It's okay. It's a table, right? I have a bit of chalk on my hands. Oh, and it leaves indents. Look at that. Look at those indents. Looks like alien faces. Hmm? Looks like alien faces. Oh. Now, oh. I'm going to try the world looking part of it. So I'm going to try this area here. So we're going to dig in the middle. Oh, we found another one already. How? Look at that. A, a smack bang in the centre of the world. The indent of the world. How did you... Well, I haven't even... I found these only two jet... Well, um, like, 
You know, we've got a brush and a waver on it, so you know exactly where the edges are, so you know how far to dig down. See, this is why you've got the brush. Look, this is why you've got the brush. You slowly brush the stuff away at the side. Of it. See where the edges of the stones are? That's where you dig. You're digging all the way out here, trying to think it's there's some really big stone. It's not. There are only little stones, really. So you just keep digging away. Wait, and brushing it's, away. It's a bit like there. Yeah, so you just keep brushing until you reveal the sides of the stone. Don't dig too far down because if it's still stuck too much, it will snap the little chisel. And if you flicks in your eye, then it's going to hurt, isn't it? I'm just like scraping it like across. Does it it's work little... if you scrape it across like that to make it easier? Uh, it could do, but it could also damage the rock. See, like, look, I've only just little dip, dug that little bit in, look, and look, it's revealed more and more. I'm just doing that to make this reveal more. That's it. We'll reveal more of this stone. This one just looks like a, a white, clear stone. Like a solid white stone. Let me see if I can pick it up, my finger. Dig that out a bit more. Stone's a bit long. Kind of shaped like an egg. One's kind of shaped like an egg. Unfortunately, these things are very messy. But that in lies the fun. Mine's very hard. Well, yes, I know some of them you have to submerge in water, but they're the small ones. I think that's just so you don't break the plastic that's inside them. See, because these are stone, you don't need to submerge these in water because the stones will not break. Well, I'm going to see a metal chisel. Well, unless you, you're supposed to just use the chisels that they provide. Yeah, but if you have your own chisel and it's like a loose, like, and it's still plastic, you don't have to use their one, you can use your one if you want. Yeah, I suppose. Or if it's big, I know. Like but then more. again, you're at more risk of breaking the stones. And if you have rubber on your chisel, so you, if, you, if your hands get sweaty, that's actually good. Yeah, like a rubber grip handle. Yeah, so it's like easier to grab hold of. Hey, we've revealed my egg. I'm going to call him a dino egg. Shaped like a dino egg. But it's a solid white. Let's brush him off. Give me nose. Alright, so. There's the, dino, the stone that I'm calling a dino egg. Because it looks very similar to an egg. But a very small one. Or a chicken egg. Yeah, so I'll put that with the rocks and we'll see if we've got any more. So, so far I have one, two, three, four, five. Pretty cool rocks. I don't even have one. Well, you will. You just gotta keep digging at it, right? How are you good at this? Because um, it's not that I'm good at it, right? It's just, uh, for some reason I'm getting really lucky and finding where Have you done this place. before? Of course we've done this before, right? You know no, I mean, like. Am I like when you were a oh, child? No. When you were like a child. Mine cracked. Is that early? That's actually, if it reveals a corner of your gym, that Look at that. Good. One smooth piece of. Break it. I tool. didn't break it. No, I don't want to break it, right? That was pretty cool. Oh, and I've got a stone revealed in this part. Too. I said and that it would be great if it revealed a corner of a stone. Yeah, well, and it did. So I, I actually predicted something that was actually. That actually happened. Well, you didn't actually predict it. You said it wouldn't be great if it happened. You were just saying if it happens, it'd be good. cool. And it did happen. So, yeah, pretty cool. I did predict it then. Because uh, I said it would be cool if it did happen. And it did. So, I technically predicted it. Well, you if, you pre if you say that if it would be good and it actually happens, then that actually still is predicting. Actually, what prediction means is where if you say, oh, it's going to break and it's going to reveal a stone. That is a prediction, right? Because you're saying it is going to do it. But you said if, implying that it may or it may not. But it did. Yes, it did. So but that was just did. pure luck. That was just luck, right? That's your luck, not mine. I know. And this, oh, this gem's square. How, how did you even it looks break like that? A, it looks like a hard boiled lolly. I know you said How did you even break that? It, uh, some of the chalk underneath, um, when I pressed down, it just broke it. Mm. Oh, come on. oh, look at that. It looks like a lollipop. A square body. See through. Wow. Oh, my chisel lifting it. Are you getting it? My chisel lifted it. Right, well, then dig it out more sides. Oh. There you go. Mm. Now brush it up. Use your tweezers. Alright. Like 
so. Wait, I have this gem it, ah. in that like, collection thing. Don't do that, don't do that. Oh, I keep moving. Oh, no. It's dirty again. I need to brush this stuff off. I need to brush. All right, so. Oh, drop me stone. I still got a fanny. Hmm. Oh. Alright, so that's the other little stone. It looks like a lolly, a square lolly. Wait, now I can dig under this one. See through and square. Now I can oh. dig under this one. Now I put you over there. Now I have room to dig under this one. Yep, but you can also dig from this side too, right? You just reveal the sides. So see, look. And the more you reveal, the easier it is for you to dig it out. Is there any more in this rock? I don't think there is. And then on. I just, I just, I done this. Look, I just levered it up. Oh, that was my thumb. Yep. And just flipped down. Because I was like, you yeah, eat that. I made that stupid rock. Grab that chalk. I'm just going to break this in half because I want to see if there's a rock or stone in it. No, no stone in that one. Let's try in this one. This one does not. And it's safe to say there's no rocks in that one either. Okay, so we'll move that to one side. And this piece here too. And I'll just tip the excess chalk off. And this time we'll just move everything across. We'll just sweep it up with a little broom known as a brush. So there's nothing that's going to crack or reveal any stones without us actually digging it up. Right, let's try somewhere over here near the discovery letters. Or could that be? Who knows? It might even be that the fact that there's only five, one, two, three, four, five, six gems in there. How many did it say? I don't know. Did it say seven? No, it didn't say any. Oh, it said ten. It said ten. Ten gems, was it? Yeah, ten. Okay, well, then there's still more to find then. So you have five more to go. If you find five more, then you need all the gems to do that. And then you can start helping me. Yeah. I haven't dug it well bit yet. Did you? Not really. Okay, did you dig the other one out? Oh, yep, you got two of them. Did you show the camera your stone? No. Why not? Uh, and I have two trophies. Can you, like, at least lift them up so you can show them? Right. Well, these are Riley's stones. I'm going to need to brush these off. They're still dusty, Riley. I got um, a green stone that gem. You got a green that stone looks, similar to that, mine, that but looks, different shape. But looks like her emerald, and they also have the and same. And also a white one as well. Like it looks like a Mentos. One. Looks kind of like a Mentos, but Mentos. it's oddly shaped Mentos. It's called Mentos. Mentos, Mentos, Mentos. I'm English, Riley. Therefore, I pronounce them differently to you. That's fair enough. I know, but the the, we just so call there is Mentos. no right or wrong. We just call Mentos, but it's okay. So. They're his two, and he shall be revealing more shortly. I found another stone, and I'm going digging to, this. Cool. Now I'm just trying to get it out. Oh, I've, I've revealed another one. Well, oh, this one's chocolatey color. Brown. That's chocolate, right? Chocolate is brown. I know. It's chocolate color. It looks like a coke color. Oh, I forgot about this other stone. Oh wow, this one's got different colours in it. I forgot when I found like that like other see-through stone. Yep. Like that see-through see yeah, stone, well, I found the thing right See, there. this is why I told you, you have to brush it away. See, there's I two think... stones, one stone there, one stone there. I forgot that I dug that one out. You forgot because you didn't scrape the excess dust away from the chalk. From I the just stone. revealed the whole top by just scraping it across. Mm -hmm. I just done that. Look at this stone. Pretty cool. Oh, wait. Hmm? I got some. Yeah, well, just be careful, Riley. Why do you think I'm not even I'm not even holding the rock? 
That's why I'm just digging down slowly. Are you repeating the pink one like mine? I'm not repeating this one. Oh, okay. It looks like a maroon colour. Okay. Oh, come on, loosen up. That's it, get loose. That's it, loosen up. There we go, almost. Let's try and see if we get out with the tweezers. There we go, we got it and it's flying off. Did you pick it up with the tweezers? I tried, it picked it up and then it just let go. Where oh wow, it? it's got light browns, mustardy browns. Kind of looks like a wood, doesn't, doesn't it? it? Oh yeah. Does uh, it look... If you look at the camera, it oh. looks like it's changing stripes on it, like it has stripes and they move just by the reflection of the light. Doesn't it actually kind of look I'm actually going to use a magnifying glass on this one. Dad, oh, yeah, that looks pretty cool. It's got a little stripe mark. Too. And when it's like it's brown, so doesn't it kind of look like um, like a light coke color, like a light brown coke? Kind of. What? It looks like an insect got stuck in it as it's born, but it's not. It's just an imperfection. How do you know if um, it, uh, it looks like it? Look, it looks like a little label or something got in it. But How do you know? It doesn't. I don't know, right? That's why I said it looks like one. If it is. And who would be dumb enough to smash these? I don't know. Well, this person is a, it tried to smash a diamond with a metal hammer. And it didn't even break. I'm trying to do what you did. Take out the tweezers. It's only going to work right if it's loose enough. I only broke the tweezers. Oh, I've got a greyish blue. No, oh, I revealed another stone. It's a see through one. Is it? What right there? Remember what I said, Riley. If you reveal the stone, brush away the dirt. That way you don't cover up other stones. And that way you get the nice colours of whichever stones you're in. Is it? No, there's not one. They're not going to be small, Riley, so don't think you can get them out just by digging the top off and that's it. They're going to be pretty big. See, look at all those, they're pretty big stones. You say, you said they're going to be small. Some are, yeah, like that see-through one here, that's a small one. And that little square one, that's a small one. But then you get that one, look, it's quite, it's quite a biggish one. Or like my green one. Yeah, very similar, yeah. Just a different shape. <sighs> oh, we've revealed more of this one. Let's scrape it out. Still needs more scraping out. Right, brush down the excess. I think this should be able to come out now. Yep, got it. Revealed. Beautiful. What was it? This one's like a purplish, purpley colour. What one? This one. It's like a purple oh. colour. I thought it was one about like this maroon one that I have. After we've finished picking all these out and digging these out, we'll give them a nice wash and see what they look like after they're all really clean. And yeah, my ones are all dusty. See, can you look? He looks like kind of crystallised. See, look, he's got different colours in him. He's got like a see-through white and a bit of purple. No, it's like a blue. transparent seat, they're white and a blue. Then look at all the different colours and shapes on that. It's beautiful, isn't it? It looks like um, it has like transparent, like a bit of like grey yeah. or something beautiful. in the white Six that eight. makes it like darker so you can't see straight through. Yeah. But it kind of also looks like um, a bluish purple. Yeah, so I've got two more stones to find. 
And I think I found one of them already. Look at that. What's it look like? It's, wow, shiny. Look, it's got glitter in it. What? Does it look like this? No. So yours is that so yours is like kind of like that one at the minute, or it could be the solid one. Oh god. That's all right. Bit of chalk. I've got chalk on my hands. It's my sword. Oh really? Right. It's only a little blister. It's not going to make a difference. It's chalk. It's not going to do nothing. It's not going to hurt anything. Well, this is a pretty cool stone. I like this one. I think this one's my favourite. Why is it your favourite? Because it's got those beautiful colours in it. it. Makes it look like a disco rock, like a disco ball, but a rock. So disco rock. Yeah, disco rock. Ooh, ooh, disco, disco. Disco ball, ooh. Disco, disco. Ooh, ooh. Disco ball rock. Don't mess with the Zohan. Don't mess with the rock. Oh, yeah, you don't want to mess with the rock. No, don't mess with the rock. I know. Now look, don't mess with the rock. I know. Don't know why you have to repeat yourself. It's supposed to be a joke. I know, it was pretty funny too. Was I pointing at the rock? Pretty clever. What? The joke. It was a pretty clever joke. Was I pointing at the rock and I said, Yes, right, you don't have to overdo it. It was a joke. I got it. Oh, come on. Get out of there. Come on. Get out of there. Give me my cool rock. Oh, another bit there. Oh, I think I found my last rock too. It's over there. When? There. Oh. See? Is it one on here or one? I don't know. Are they all in the same place? No, right. They would not be in all the same place. Hey. Because they're randomly made. They're just put in a place and then they have the cast of the chalk cast over them. Oh. Well, this must be a pretty big one. A pretty deep one, anyway. Because it's getting hard. It's not very easy to get out. It's wiggling, but it just doesn't want to come out. Wow, look at that one. It looks like a dice. An unnumbered dice. That's a glitter one. I know. It's pretty damn cool. Look at that. Beautiful. I would say that's more like an orangey brown. Ouch. Aha. Uh -huh. Injury. <coughs> See, look at the glitter on that. They're a very shiny rock. Looks just like a dice, but without numbers. Pretty cool. I think that one's my favourite one, so. Oh, I, I just done that and flicked the whole bit off. Okay, we're trying I, not to break I just, anything. I done that and, and just flicked it off and I revealed two gems. Cool. I knew there was going to be one over here, that's why I was trying to dig over there. Okay, but you haven't even dug another one out yet. You've... It's because it's hard. I, found, I think I found a Coca Cola. I found a glittery one. You found a glitter one? Oh wow, cool. It's like a mineral thing. Like a glittery mineral. Could those glitter bits be a mineral? Uh, no, I don't think so. Uh, um, actually, to be honest, I don't really know. All rocks are minerals, technically. Well, they have minerals. Yes. They're made of them and they have them in them. Hence why they're a mineral. But you can't eat them. No, why would you eat a mineral? It's not a minstrel. What's a minstrel? It's a chocolate minstrel. They're made out of chocolate. It's made by Nestle. And they're really nice. Mm. Can you even get them anymore? It's like a cho chocolate disc. Can you even get them anymore? An English shop does them, Marley, in Perth, in WA, Western Australia. Well, look at that. I found a small white sock. I chocolate in my leg. Yeah, that's cool. What can wipe that? You can wipe No, that because way. I had to scratch my leg. That's fine. And, and I had chalk in my head. Okay. I think I'm going to dig from the side. Like, there. Okay, well, that's the last stone that I have to find. So I've got all my stones. And now for wait for Riley to finish his and reveal his stones, and then we can clear up. And then, um, we can wash them after and then we're just gonna um, show them after we wash them yep but i have to get mine out you don't need to dig that hard though Riley. i do would you like daddy to help or 
No. Well, I can dig these ones out if you want it while you dig the other ones. No. Okay, well then I'll just sit here then. Yep. Just sit here. What are you trying to do? I'm going to make a smiley face out of a few broken pieces. Are you even trying to help me? Nope, because you said you didn't want my help. So, if you don't want my help, that is fine. Come on, help me. I am making my smiley face. I done my smiley face, look. What? Look, one door, got a light. Okay, but you're supposed to be finding your rocks. I'm going to, but I kind of need help now. Doing this. There's my smiley face. So if you need help, then let me help. I will get your chisel. I've got it right here. Help! Talk to me properly. You said you want help. Right, you dig those two out and brush them. Like, like I said, brush, just brush away at the, the sides. The more you reveal, the less you have to dig. Is that true? Yes, right. That's why I've got all ten of mine out already. How do you do it so quick? Because you brushed every time. Yep, yeah, every time I dug one out, I brushed it. And if it didn't come out that way, I just scraped it out a bit. I'm trying to make like a deep enough hole so I can dig it out too. How deep do you think this thing stone is in? I don't know. You're spraying it on my stone. What that? Mind your hand. And then after this, we just have to wash them. Yeah, we'll wash them. But I can probably dig that out. Hold on, hold on, don't, don't, don't go digging it out just yet, right? That's right. Both do it, both do it. No, just let me even film more of the stone first. Wait, you dig there and I um... No, because you're going to flick it out, Riley, and it's going to break. Or it's going to break something. Riley, it's designed to come out easily. You don't have to struggle. It's bending your chisel. And that's because you're trying to dig it out when you haven't dug enough away. When you dig more away, see how it loosens it up? No, no, don't do that. You've got to brush it away. Brush the excess away and it reveals the stone, you see? Just dig it out. There you go. Right, so oh, it's like that pink one. Okay, well then brush it off and put it with your pile and then we can show them what at the end. Well, that's too much stuff on. Alright, let's get rid of some of this more chalky dust. Do you want to um, work on trying to dust this off? No, you can dust off. Just use your brush. Careful. And these have like two scratches on them. Yeah, and they're, they're all like scratches. No, I'm going to put them over there. We, and it will get rid of it up when we dust it off. Oh, shit. Here go the other ones. Look at the other ones. The more stones you get out, the quicker the better it is. Oh, there we go. We've revealed him. You there brush him off. Alright, I'll brush him off then. Because my one's too dirty. It's not too dirty at all. I'm using the same brush as you are. Yeah, but my brush has too much chalk because it's been laying on the damn chalk. Oh, well, so Riley's got one that looks kind of marblish. How do you have so many like this? It looks very marblish. Like How did you get these? It's just what came off the top. How? It's that top layer that covered the bottom layer. Oh, covered the rocks. Right, let me. You think you need like, well, I like, close to there so it can, like, work. And then I'll make it like. That one's pretty cool. Kind of multi colored. Yeah, one like that. No, I have a similar see through one that's square. Kind of. Wait, it changes colour in the light, but not so much. Mine like looks yours. like a white green there, a bit of like white there, and a bit of blue. Yeah, I think it's got a bit of reflective surface. It, it kind of looks like a mermaid in blue or green. Okay, since when are mermaids blue or green? 
Um, their tail. Ah, uh, revealed in the distance. Their tail, you mean? The tail. Oh, are you on about like the reflective scales? Yes. Of a mermaid. Those tails of a mermaid can also be any colour. I'm right about that. Yeah, I guess they could be if they existed. Yeah, they. Maybe, maybe it's chisel. Keep going over there. Mm -hmm. I'll reveal this for you. I'm going to dig this. No, you can't dig that out, Riley, right, no. until you've got this stone out. It's tall. You can't, because you're covering where I am. I'm going to grab it. I take the right. Be careful, Riley. Right. You asked me to help. I'm trying to help, but you keep going in the way. Like I said, you can't get another stone out until you revealed another one. There we go, I got him. He's a clear one, so he's not multicolored, he's clear. You brush him. He's the clear one. Oh, he's got a bit of black in him. Hmm? Like a black flex. Oh, I didn't even realize. Oh, we all like it. Oh, it's got like a whirlwind inside. Hmm? A whirlwind inside. If you look at the thing, it looks like a dust devil or something. Yeah, it looks like a tornado or a dust devil on the inside of that rock. Well, I don't know whether you guys can see it, but it's kind of what it looks like. Yeah, it kind of looks like that to us, but I don't mind it. Maybe. I just Oh, I revealed a bit of the bottom of the stone. Well, by digging under. Yeah, well, don't dig it out the side, Riley, because that's just how it's going to break everything. Wait, this is a deep stone. Look, look how deep that stone is. That's cool. Wow. Yeah. Wow. It's pretty cool. Yeah, um, um, those ones I haven't looked at really that many of us. Let's push them all that away. Wait, I didn't know that was the... Mm, that's... That is a bit of like that reflective white. I think that one's going to be like this purple here. Very similar. Yeah, but mine's like a dark, like aqua blue. Or, or like navy blue. Push that away. Oh, careful. Yeah. I just lifted a whole bit over the top. Yes, but please be careful. I'm trying. Get some more stone build. I need more of this one with eels. Yeah, uh, I'm just digging around the side to loosen up the soil. That uh, soil, sorry, not soil. Chalk. We'll loosen up the stone and the chalk. I was thinking I was actually out in a real digging area. Yeah, you do sometimes think that. And I thought it might be like mine. It's got a lot of purple in it and it and the blue grey. And a bit of grey. Like it's half and half. And a bit of navy blue in it. Yeah. Don't you kind of see a bit of navy blue? Yeah, I can see a little bit of And it kind of has like that little transparent white too. As you can see, it's got two it's two-toned. So it's got like a grey colour here. And the purplish colour here, and on the back it's got like a dark blue with a similar grey kind of and like a navy purple. Blue. So can... well, that's a pretty cool stone. Now can you help me with this glitter? I could, but then I wouldn't be able to reveal this. Wait. What are you doing? Get the stuff out of there, just in case there's any stones underneath. Pretty sure the stones are pretty much as high as, you, as they are. Because there could actually be stones underneath that stone. Sometimes. I don't think they've got a stone underneath the stone, right? It's supposed to get, get in it. I know. I know I stabbed this stone. I did. I can flip that one out now. Can you? Yeah. Oh, there you go. 
Yeah, give it a good brush. Brush it No, you brush it off, Roddy. You took it out. Alright, everywhere I touch on it, it just gets more beautiful down. Is it on your hand? Oh, we got him! You don't have much on yours. It looks like a shell. Look at my hand. So right, every time I it's touch it. We've got to wash them anyway. This one looks like a shell. Look. Looks like the top of a shell. Who's that? Like Whose stone is that? Yours. Where, where'd you get that one? I got that one out there. See if this one looks right there or there. I don't know if there is or not. How many stones have you got? Two, one. four, six, eight. So you got two more stones to get. This is one of them. So you got nine there. Don't do not do what's it. Just kind of chip it away at the sides. And then as you chip away at the sides, brush the dirt away. So These are dirt. Yeah, they're dirt. 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 Technically, dirt. Chalk, dirt, soil. All the same thing. Not quite, but there you go. Right, it's too deep. You've got too much stuff around the side of it for you to be able to flick it out. So stop trying. Move your hand. Stop trying to hit it from the side because there's nothing there. I know, I'm trying to make it so it will reveal. It won't. Because all you're doing is digging out of the sides. You're not actually revealing anything. No, this is going here. Where's your stone here? Where's the stone in these tiny pieces? Could there be a stone in here? No, of course there won't be a stone in there, Riley. Don't do that, you're making more mess. You're just making a mess, Riley. I, I touched one of your stones, it's working out. That's fine. And it has dropped. Yeah, no, that's fine. It's gotta get washed. What are you doing? You're supposed to be digging for rocks. Here, clean that up. Clean that one. Don't want to build your hand in there. So clean it. There's a rug in my hand. Look, there's a rug in my hand and it's doing more. <laughs> and it brushes. Is that. Do I have nine there? Nine, yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yep, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Is there any other stone? I don't know, Riley. I'm trying to look. Oh, it broke. Well, it didn't reveal a stone, so it could still be in there. Could be in here. Look underneath. It's not underneath, Riley. Like Look to see if like it's there. not underneath, Riley. Every stone we collected has all been on here. when I was doing mine, it snapped off too. Could be normal. I think you might be the one to find the rock, I think. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's not in this one. Well, we don't know. We haven't dig further enough to look. Maybe that's on the side. Should I snap this one? Should I snap this one? No, because then that's not doing the thing you're supposed to be doing, is it? Digging. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's not going to be in this one, right? It might be in this. Yeah, no, I'm pretty sure it's not. How do you? It'll be too far down if it is. I found it! There you go, I didn't think it was in this one. I thought, like, there was a bit, like, there or something there. It's like one of those cuts. There we go. Oh, 
Yeah, let's reveal some more of it. See, that's the last, the very final stone out of Riley's archaeology set. Okay. Well, Alright, so, yeah. so we're going to pause the video for now and clean up well, and then we'll much, reveal the stones that we all have. So pretty much we'll take a break and wash them and then we also, I'll wash my hands. Yep, yeah, we'll clean up. And then we'll do the big reveal at the end. I'm gonna go. Over All right. There. So we're back shortly. Welcome back after our short break. We've finally cleaned our stones off. And we washed our hands. No, you don't need to pour it. Well, we cleaned everything up. All the tables nice and clean again. And the floor. And the floor. Yep, the floor is all nice and clean again. And my shortcut. Right, sure. Shush. Um. So, these are the ten stones that I have. And if Riley shows you his, just took your, took your bowl over. Mine is like um, a Took your bowl over, show them all these stones. And this way, right, to the camera. See, they're all his stones, plus the one in his hand. I've got one square one that's got glitter all through it, like it's really sparkly. Look, like the one I mentioned, it looked like a dust, but without the numbers on it, the little dots. So that's that a one. A little glittery looking one. And then I've got a white one that is now it looks like a Mentos. Yeah, again, it looks like a Mentos. Mentos. Mentos, I am English, I'm not Australian. Um, then we've got one like that like kind of like looks like half a triangle if you look at it. Or kind of like um, a bit of a transparent. Oh, uh, it's not transparent, Riley, really. you can't see through it. This one's, uh, one looks more like marbleish, marbleish colour. Marble. Like it's very marbly. It's pretty much marble. Yeah, and then we've got this one, which I said looks like it has an insect in it, but it's not. I don't think it's an insect. I think it's just a, a blemish in the, in the stone as it's formed. Or it could be. An and if you turn it around this way onto the side of it, in the light, it kind of looks like it's got more than one see. line, and then it see. doesn't. Let me see. So you look, if you look, see how it looks? It looks like the line, you've got a thick brown line, and then you have no brown line, and then you have a thick brown line, and oh, a thin yeah. one. Yeah, I see that. So that kind of changes its... So it's kind of like it's trippy. And it looks like the inside of a rock. Yeah, it looks like, like inside of a, a a log or something like a kind of like, like it looks tree. like yeah, it looks like the veins inside of a tree. But I think it may, uh, to sum it up, I would say it looks like it's encased in glass when it's not. Pretty much. So um, then I've got this one. Like um, like an aqua. Yeah, it's like an aqua. Green. aqua Aqua light green. Yeah, yeah and, it, and as again, it looks like it's shaped like a toothpick. Is it? Uh, it's a guitar it? pick for a guitar. Or a it, triangle. Yeah, well, tooth, uh, guitar you, picks are it. shaped like a triangle, Riley. Really. Yeah, but they're more smooth. Um, then we've got this one, which is a transparent one, but it's more cloudy Trans than it is anything else. Transparent, it's not transparent. It is transparent, not transparent. And it's again triangularly shaped. Kind it's got a lot of thick white cloudiness in it, but it is see through again. So we've got that one, and then we've got the one that looks like a say it look, looks like a cough cough lolly, like what you'd eat, what you'd have if you've got like a little cough or. Or it kind of looks cold. like, and in the light it kind of reflects in it. Yeah, it, it kind it of makes changes. it look like it has colours, but it actually doesn't. Yeah, it kind of looks purplish in the it, light. And it kind of makes it look like mermaid scales. Okay. Well, it kind of looks purplish, but when you look at it close up, it's basically it's just clear white, very clear, like a glass. So we got also this one, which it also looks like glass, and it has quite a bit of grey in it, actually, when you look really close. But as you look at a distance, it, you can't really see it. So I think that's pretty cool. 
And then we've got this one here, which has pink in it. When we, when I was digging it out, it looked like it was a solid pink. But, but now, when I got it out, it's but, now actually transparent. With and it pink. kind of looks like it has like pink veins inside. Yeah, it kind of looks like ice where you, you know, you put food colour in ice or water and you get that little kind of a shimmery effect through the water with the colour. But yeah, I think that's pretty cool as well. And then you got this one, which I thought was blue when I was digging it out and grey, but it's not. It's actually purple with a bit of like, I would say that it's kind of a, a greyish blue just here on the, on the end of it. And it and kind of looks like a tooth. Like a, like a shark tooth, maybe? No, I'd say more like a no, little look. dinosaur tooth. No, like a shark tooth. Oh, look. Off, look, like a shark tooth like this. Yeah, well, I like, wouldn't agree with that, but like that's Like a mole of a shark. Yeah, you might think it looks like that, but I think it looks more of a dinosaur tooth. Mm. Uh, so that's all, that's all my stones. So we'll move these aside and Riley will show you his. Um, first I have like this navy bluish black. I kind of have like this it's about um, navy blue and black and purplish, like light purple, like violet colour. And like a greyish um, white, um, right there, yep. and it look, and it has like this little like mark on it. Right, cool. And now I'm gonna right, show put that there so they can see it when you can explain it. And here's uh, my white one that also looks like a Mentos. And yep, kind of. It, it kind of has like white little dots you can just see. Yep, like a specks of like, uh, solid white. Yeah, like a crystal kind of marble effect. Put it over there with the rest. Okay. And where are you revealing them? That's it. And this one I have like a kind of square and has like a bit of slanted on the top. Yeah, very similar to the one I showed you previously. It looks like a dust. And it um, yeah. kind of looks like a um, slanted square of it. Um, and a look. it's all glittery. Yep, let me look. Like that. Look. The exact same. It looks very similar to one of those hexagon uh, misshapen dice. You know, you have like six sides, uh, seven sides on it, or something. Or it like kind of looks like this, where you have like a diamond that goes like um, that, and then that, and then that, and then that. Okay. All around. Okay. So what next? What we got next? Um, this like green looking emerald looking thing, and there's like white. Oh yeah, it's got like a white stripe across it. And very then unique. Show them. You don't have to show me your other. Yeah, it's like white and like dark. It has dark green and like a bit of a um, bit of white, like um white stripes on the rock, and there's like bits of um, um like um, marks on it. Yep. So over there with the rest of them. And this one I have like a little whitish and. Um, but in the pink. light, it can't, yeah. I was gonna in, say in the light. A little whitish pink. I was gonna say in the light. Um, and the, it's like um bubblegum pink. Yeah, kind of. And there is like, say, yeah, more and there's like a mark like right there, but I don't know if you can see it. Oh, wait, let's have a look. Let's have a look at this mark. It's like, like, there's a mark. Oh, oh, yeah, it looks like it's been cracked, but it actually hasn't. It's no, where the right form right of it is. Okay, yeah, okay, so. like it looks like a crack, but it's not. It's like just right, on the inside of the rock, because no, the actual like, outside of the rock like is really right smooth. There, like right there. I know, right, I've seen it. Put the rock right there, yep. Yeah. So that's, that's five and of them. And now I have this like, Mine, like, that bit kind of looks like, like, seaweed or moss, like, a moss oh, okay. There's, like, a one Show or the two, camera. there's, like, one or two, like, and dark green dots, and there's a bit of white on it, and when, moss when has that. When they've got dots on them, you call them specks, like, it's a speck of green or a speck of blue. And, um, white, and um, some moss has white and dark green on it, and... The light green on here actually makes it look like have like a bit of a shade of like dark and light. Yep, yeah, well, I think it's pretty cool too. And now, yeah, it looks like a very cool, very cool little stone. Now I have like this, like one that looks like that. Oh, like, very, yeah, very similar, but you got more all, pink. But than it's yours. all pink, and Dad's. Only yeah, yours is a pink with a see through and white through it. And there's like a couple marks on it, but I can't really tell if you can see it, so I'm going to point yeah. at them. Some right there and one down there. Okay, so it very very similar to this one, but the colours were reversed. So instead of this being more white or clear, his is more pink. 
Instant and less clear. of the clear. Instant clear. Yeah, so it's very similar. And now I have this little one. And what's that, that one? And this one, that one that looks like a duster one. And a what? That one. Oh yeah, the one that looked like it had a little mini tornado inside it. Um, it looks like there's like a crack okay, there. It looks like there's a little crack here. Too close. But, and if you look closely, you see like a little like grayish and um, like darkish white going down the middle and it kind of looks like a dust devil or like a tornado. Yeah. And it has like something that looks like a, um, a scratch or like crack in it, but yeah, it's well, not. And there's also a mark there and a mark there. Yeah, well I think the imperfections make these rocks very unique. Put it over there. Like and it makes it very unique. Like I, no rocks are the same. It's pretty I cool. I also have this like rock that looks like that has like black and like lightish brown. Does light that change color with the line? And it has like a bit of like maroon on the bottom. That one doesn't change the colors though. And this one can't. If you look, it does at look it, darker though when you, you move it. If you it. look at it from this angle, it kind of looks like a little maroon color. And then if you look over here. It's like a black colour. Yeah. And he has like black, light ish, dark brown right on the side. Yes. And he has like a light brown and dark brown dark brown over here and light brown over there. Okay. Oh, yeah. is that it? Or are you more? And, and there's Oh and, you got one more here? And I'm not don't show it yet. Um and there's like this little bump that has like light brown and dark brown on the top. Okay. Like, a little bump. Yep, that's it. Show the camera. It looks like the, a, so viewers. It, it looks like a volcano, but on top of a gigantic rock that looks like a triangle. That's pretty look, cool. If you look at it like that, it looks like a triangle. But if you look like it, it okay. looks like it's on like a triangle mountain. Okay, can't have to explain that. And it kind of also it looks like okay, a shark. Okay, I'm pretty sure that yeah. Shark. Okay, so moving on to the next one. And now this is the last one. This one changes in the light. And it and when you move it around like that, it kind of has like an orange. If you see the orange there, and it has like a bit of a light shade of what yeah, kind of looks, looks rainbowish and, and a bit of yellow, and it kind of makes it look like um rainbow mermaid scales. Mm, and cool. it's like a bit of a slanted square, just like that one. Yeah, it looks pretty cool. It yeah, looks so like it when you put it down. It actually, looks like it's got a square inside a square. Huh? Have you noticed that? Yeah, look. Um, it looks like it's got another, another well, stone. That's the edge of the, um, um, of the square. Yeah, that's actually what I'm just um, a regular square. That's what I was saying. It looks like a square inside a square, but when you put it really close to your eyes, that disappears. And it's got like a little ball in there, though. Mm. That's where it's formed. It's uh, captured a bit of air in it, or. And it's something. caught a bit of air in it, and it has you like a little bummy in it. Alright, so that's all the rocks that Riley's collected, and it's all the rocks that I've collected. So, that's all we've got time for today. Um, if you wish to see any more of these videos, please put so, a comment below and, and subscribe. So you don't miss any of our other videos, and don't forget to hit the um, notification, bell. notification button. And don't forget to like this video as well. And I hope we can at least get to like... Like yeah, 30 so. likes. 30 yeah. likes? That's very And um, if we hit 30 reasonable. likes, we'll do another of these videos. Okay, okay. Then. And if you still want to do that, just comment. Yep, so if you do wish to see any more videos, just comment below. We've done another one of these. And try to get our video to oh, um, um, again. 30 to 40 or over 30 likes. Yes, you've got to be realistic, buddy. Um, so if you do wish to see any more of these, we have done a separate one, which you will see on the channel as well, where we revealed these glow-in-the-dark sharks and crocodiles. They were little toys out of a little egg. So if you do wish to see it, please leave a comment below and we will try our best to do another one. All right, I am John. I'm Riley. And this was a Scorpion and Viper show. And together we are the Scorpion and Viper show. Yeah. Bye. Bye-bye.